Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to talk about 1975 Jefferson Nichols struck by Philadelphia Mint and find out for which amount these coins sell at superb mint condition. So as clearly seen, this Jefferson Nickel is in circulated extremely fine condition by Sheldon Ski. There is no mint mark under the date which means it was struck by Philadelphia Mint. Those with D mint mark are impressed by Denver branch of some mint. Cold nickel gray surfaces are lightly abraded but yet reflective with some remnants of nickel gray mint luster on selected areas. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, make sure to hit subscribe and bell buttons below. Reverse side displays sharp strike but not sharp enough to gain full steps designation if graded. Monticello steps display total flatness on lower few steps. Overall eye appeal is okay. The 1975 Jefferson nickel is not considered to be scarce or valuable. In fact, it is a relatively common coin that was minted in large numbers. Since the 1975 Jefferson nickel is not scarce, its value is primarily based on its condition. In circulated condition where the coin has been in circulation and shows signs of wear, the value is generally very close to its face value of 5 cents. However, if you find the 1975 in commerce and remain in a pristine state, it may have a slightly higher value to collectors. The 1975 nickels are somewhat valuable only in higher mint states with full steps on the reverse. Let's look at this nickel, for example, graded in mint state 67 plus by PCGS. This is the single finest full steps 1975 nickel known to PCGS. Beautifully toned in iridescent pastel shades, the surfaces are both fully struck and expertly preserved. Sold in 2021 for $4,560 at Stax Powers. Thanks for watching this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. See you later.